So, once again, Gary Lineker has upset the, what I would say, Patriots on the right-hand side of the game by going off the unwritten code. <laughs> You're crazy. Am I? Yes. Am I? Yes. Am I? So Gary Lineker sent out a tweet in reference to the fans that booed the England players for taking a knee at a international football game. And in his tweet, he goes on to say this. If you boo at England players for taking the knee, you're part of the reason why players are taking the knee. Now, it's understandable that I, myself, would agree to what he said. <laughs> no surprises there, eh? Oh, no, no, no. So, why the animosity towards Gary? And what is it about what he said that has angered or enraged those on the Patriot side of the game so much? And what I put it down to is, like I said, he's gone off code. Yeah, he is seen as being an anti-British. And the issue here for me is that those on the Patriot side of the game, they insist on not distinguishing the difference between what I would say Black Lives Matter, the organisation, the fraudsters and the blah, blah, blah. A lot of people would have issues with uh, the organised movement Black Lives Matter. Versus what I would say, black people, the boots on the ground, who have experienced certain actions. There is the message Black Lives Matter with which right. most people would agree even without subscribing to some of the more radical elements of, of, of the organised movement. But to make these two different aspects synonymous don't work for me. I can't separate the slogan and the organisation because they've essentially become one and the same. Seeing the true essence of Black Lives Matter should not be conflated with the actions of a few individuals that have gone out and done some crazy madness. So when it comes to Gary Lineker now, trying to show people this difference. And I think it's important that people stand up and, and speak out against these things. Uh, it's not always easy. He's in the position that allies find themselves in because when they try to say, or when they try to express or show that they have an understanding of where the black perspective is coming from, they meet this brick wall or they meet this barrier of why, why do you um, think the players before, are doing it? I I know the reasons that, that they've said that they're doing it. Um, so you booed I'm that not, then? Uh, no. Um, my so, point, so you booed the reasons that they haven't said? My undertone is that when I hear the word Black Lives Matter, I think of burning buildings in America, attacking the police and violent protests. Yes. So I'm not... Have you anti, tried not I'm to? Not, I, other white people saying that they're in the wrong and why are you supporting them? But let everyone have their opinion, people like Gary Lineker, so we can see what such an ass he really is. I mean, I can't understand these people's mindset. So why are you supporting them? Because they will attack you. You know what I'm saying? And to me, all I can say is that, look, I give Gary Lineker all the props for what he's trying to do because it seems to me that he does at least grasp the notion or not, not the notion but he does understand or sees the, the 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 motive and the essence of black lives matter from a black person's perspective whereas many of the far right and the patriots they only see black lives matter from their own perspective as in their standards and how they want to say it these fans understand that black lives matter is a destructive vengeful and murderous movement that aims to divide us even more. And if you support Black Lives Matter, then the problem's with you. For the people who are the patriots, they come up with all these straw man arguments. As long as you've had a black US president, even though he's mixed heritage, billionaire black sports stars, black judges, black generals, black officers in the army, and Black Lives Matter want to defund them. They want to get rid of the police. What they're scared of is having their position challenged by any other group because they're comfortable with it. So what do you think qualifies uh, you to say, oh, I know that's why you say you're doing it, but I know better? As in being in that authoritative position in which they 
feel that they are the righteous, they are the superior, and they are the X and they are the Z, and any other group that was to... Are you challenging me? In order to make a better society for everybody, they don't like that, right? But anyway, I'm kind of rambling and I've gone off topic, but going back to Gary Lineker, yeah, <laughs> yes, I would argue that yes, you know, right, I support him in what he said, yeah, and the truth is, those who are against him are just afraid of him going against the grain, yeah, he's breaking the unwritten code, right, as in, you know, being anti-white, and they seem as a traitor but let me let but let me know what you think in the comments below and don't forget to like share and subscribe i'm out peace yes am i yes am i yes